What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Today, if you haven't guessed it, we're going to do a little treat. Just in time for the NFL playoffs, everybody goes, what can I have besides chips and salsa? How about something with a little bit of body on it? How about something that is so simple you can make it within 30 to 40 minutes? I'm talking about chili dip. So if you guys are very interested in this video, don't forget to smash that thumbs up button, subscribe down below to my channel, and also everything you need to know after you watch this video is also down in the subscription box down below. So if you guys are ready to get cooking, as always, I am that guy to do it for you. Let's get it. First things first, preheat that oven to 400 degrees so that is ready to go. Your prep time is going to consist of five minutes. Get yourself some cooking spray, some shredded cheese of your choice, two packs of Philadelphia cream cheese, and two cans of Hormel chili, and also a 9x9 baking pan. You're then going to start with your Philadelphia cream cheese. Place two packets on a paper plate or a microwave safe plate. You're going to pop it in the microwave for about 30 to 50 seconds just to soften it up so it can even out the spread. Now that you sprayed your pan, go ahead and start spreading that cream cheese nice and evenly. We're going to make this look as beautiful as possible. Then you're going to go ahead and you're going to take both cans of Hormel chili, spread that evenly as well. And then you're going to take your shredded cheese and you are going to load it on top. We want plenty of cheese to cover all that beautiful square footage we have in this pan. Now that this bad boy is ready to go in the oven, remember your oven's already preheated to 400 degrees. You're going to slide it in for about 30 minutes and she should be done. Just be sure that cheese is on top and with the magic of television, it is done and she is ready for dipping. And just for a little side note, always have you some Tostitos on hand and some crackers in case you want to make this dip recipe. And then after you plate this bad boy up, I want you to go ahead and park your behind and watch your favorite game. Well guys, that is going to wrap up another video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And if you like this video, comment down below as well. Tell me if you want to see more dip recipes. My wife, she has got a ton of more dips. This isn't just for football. This isn't just for game day. This isn't just for sporting events. This is for birthdays, having company, drinking your favorite beverage, whatever it may be. If you guys like it, smash that thumbs up button down below also. And I will see you fine, ladies and gentlemen, at the next video. See ya.